Hi everybody. Today I will discuss about bearings. What is bearings? A bearing, it is the angle that a line makes with some reference directions. And this direction usually it is north. That's what it is. For this line OA, it has bearing 55 degree 29 minutes. How it comes? Because these angles are measured clockwise from this reference direction north. As well, in surveying, these clockwise angles are considered positives. So, surely we can say the OA has a bearing 55 degree 29 minutes. If I take another line, say OB, what is its bearing? 105 degree 25 minutes because from the reference direction north I took these angles 105 degree 25 minutes clockwise that's why it is bearing for this line if I take another line surely bearing will be from this north clockwise these angles from north clockwise this angle 305 degree 39 minutes so OC angle of bearing for OC is these degrees so Let's move in the next slide to see an example to understand clearly about the bearings. So here I have taken a problem which is it says a ship travels 17 km on a bearing of 121 degree 39 minutes. So this is the starting positions. So as we know bearings means from north directions we have to take this 120 1 degree 39 minutes clockwise and then it will be the for OA bearing so that's what it is and this distance it says 17 kilometers now from this point A again it travels 25 kilometer on a bearing of from this vertical line means it is the north parallel to this north line I mean north direction this is parallel so our reference will be from this point and in clockwise 278 degree 25 minutes so bearing of this AB and distance is 25 kilometer so ship is here now So from these points, a starting point to this point, we need to find this distance as well. If ship, bearing the ship that it can travel in the straight line back to its starting position. So if ship goes back to its starting position, what will be the bearing for this line OB, I mean BO? So we need to find this, these angles and this distance. So let's first find the distance.
to find the distance OB. We need to find angle alpha, this one. Angle alpha, it is very easy to find because this total angle is 180. So 180 minus 120, 1 degree 39 minutes, surely we get alpha. So we got alpha. Again, to find the beta, it is also easy to find because totally this whole angle is, full circle angle is 360 minus of this angle minus of this alpha because already we got alpha here means here we can say this is also alpha this line and this line are parallel so easily we can find beta so for this triangle we got alpha and beta now we will apply the cosine rule for triangle OAB. So the formula is OAS, I mean OB square, because we need to find this. OB square equal to OA square plus AB square minus of 2 OA AB and cos beta. In between these two lines, this angle we have to take because beta is 23 degree 14 minutes. Using calculator, we get this distance for OB square. Now making a square root, we get OB equal to 11.53. So this sheep from the starting positions, it is 11.53 kilometer far. Now let's move ahead to find this angle gamma which is bearing for this line so what we can do we can write this angle we can write it as a gamma because this line, this direction and this direction are parallel. So surely if it is gamma, this will be also gamma. That's why I wrote here B O C it is gamma and B O A B O A alpha plus gamma. Now applying sine rule to O A B. What you can write? We can write this 25 divided by exactly opposite this angle BOA sine of this and this distance we got 11.53 divided by exactly opposite this angle BAO and BAO means we know it is beta. So we can put this value 23 degree 14 minutes. Cross multiplying, we can find this sine alpha plus gamma equal to 0.855. So using calculator, we can find alpha plus gamma equal to 58 degree 45 minutes. But here one important point. As we know, in any triangle, the longest side is always opposite the largest angle. For this triangle, longest side is AB. So surely largest angle will be this one, opposite. But here we got 58 degree 45 minutes. So this is not logical to take this value. And our AB is 25 kilometer. So what you can do? We can find this angle considering 180 degree minus of this angle. So we get 121 degree 15 minutes. 
So important point is sine of this, sine of 58 degree 45 minutes, also this value, sine of 121 degree 15 minutes also will give the same value. But we are considering this bigger angle because the biggest this side, longest side, so angle must be bigger. So 121 degree 15 minutes for this whole angle, I mean BOA, it is logical. Now, from this, if we subtract alpha, we get 62 degree 24 minutes. So this is the angle. So very easily we can say the required bearing for this line to go back here at the starting positions bearing will be 62 degree 24 minutes. I think that's all for this problem. So we are done. Thanks for watching.